Okay, in this video I'm going to show how to import a model into Unreal. This is going to be really short because it's really easy to do. Now that I've shown how to uh, create it, unwrap it, and export it. Alright, first thing I do is I like to create a new folder right under the content folder with my name on it. So I'm going to right click new folder and just call it uh, Brad Assets and there it is and so that's where I keep all the stuff that I make that's what I that's where I put all my stuff so I'm gonna double click that drag files here or right click to create content well I'm just gonna go find that uh, file that I created earlier so if I can uh, so what I did was I put it on my D drive so give me just a moment here I put it um, right here so here it is it's this uh, table 01.fbx if you'll remember we created that in the earlier video it's just a table small table 25 kilobytes that's really tiny so I'll just click it drag it and drop it right in here it will bring over look at that it brings over the materials and the textures excellent that's exactly what I want it is not a skeletal mesh there's no animation on it there's no bones in it it's just a regular just a regular static mesh and I will say import all so what it does is it brings in my actual table, the static mesh right here. It also brings in the texture, that piece of wood that I used, and it creates a material out of it. Let's go look at the material first. So let's double click it. And uh, I'll just throw this up here, and zoom in a little bit. And uh, I don't know why it does that. Why can't they make this so that when it's created, it's right there next to it? That would be so much nicer. Epic, are you listening? Do that. Anyway, that's kind of nice right there. I like it, and so I'll just save. And everything looks good from there. And I'll come back into my map. Here's my object. If I double click this, then it brings up my static mesh editor. And uh, let's take a look at my static mesh editor. There it is. There's the, the table. Zoom in here a little bit. It looks really good. I've even got some nice grain going on there. And can look up and under the table so everything seems to be just right here for my table I'm really happy with it so let's go back into here and let's just drag it right into and I can drag it anywhere pretty much I could drag it on here or in here or whatever and I like it I like my table so it looks good let's go play oh you know what let's have some fun with it well first of all play and uh, if I try to uh, Look at that, I can step right up on it. So it comes in with collision on it, that's pretty cool. It's already got collision. And uh, let's see. Now what if I, uh, instead of jumping on it, what if I wanted to just kick it around, knock it around? Down here, physics, let's simulate physics. And then hit play again. And this time, instead of jumping on it, let's just kick it around a bit. Oops, there we go. <laughs> It's almost too small for that. There we go. Knocked it all around. Anyway, so now you can just kind of have fun with it and kick it around and do whatever you want with it. So that's making a table. Uh, importing, exporting right into Unreal Engine. Thanks and goodbye.